Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to sync Microsoft OneDrive in Linux. Open the terminal and here enter the following command to install Git. All the necessary commands are in my website in the description box below. Once you press enter, you'll be prompted to enter the password. So do that, press enter to continue the installation. Do you want to continue? Yes, and press enter. Now enter the git clone command, and this will clone the um, source code to the OneDrive D folder or directory. Once done, change directory to the OneDrive D using this command. Now we need to uh, download and install all the necessary dependencies. So you need to enter this command. You'll be asked several times if you want to continue because it needs additional space for each dependencies. Make sure to select yes and press enter. Okay, done. Now let's copy and paste this OneDrive command on the same terminal. Once we do that, we have four more additional steps. So the first one would be, do you want to authorize signing with your OneDrive account? Yes, of course. So do that. And now copy this long URL and paste it on the um, address bar. Open up your browser and then right click paste. If you haven't signed in to Microsoft, do so. Now once you sign in, it's gonna ask you let this app access your info, click on yes. And now copy this um, hyperlink or URL and paste it in the terminal. Press enter. We can continue on to the second step. Do you want to specify a path to the uh, local OneDrive? Yes, of course. Now, if you haven't created a folder, you can create one. The default location would be in the uh, home directory. So I'll create it there. You can create it on the desktop if you want. New folder, and I'll name this OneDrive. Perfect. Now I'll access the folder and then copy the path. And again, paste it on the terminal. Press enter. Do you want to change the numeric settings? Nope. Do you want to edit uh, the ignore list? Nope. Done. Now we have one last command. Enter OneDrive D space start to start syncing your files to the OneDrive folder. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.